In this video, we are going to look at how to process and view your electronic remittance advice, also known as ERAs, which is the electronic version of the EOB. ERAs contain information on whether a claim was paid or denied, final status, and any adjustments the payers have made to the billed amount. Users with the ERA Auto Apply permission are able to post and process ERAs. Let's get started. Before you can receive ERAs, most payers require that you complete an additional agreement. Once the ERA agreement has been authorized by the payer, you will start receiving ERAs. To review the ERAs that are coming in, navigate to the payment section, then select ERA. Enter your search criteria, then click search. The payments in the ERA are applied to the charges automatically but need to be reviewed before posting to your account. Let's review a new ERA that just came in. Locate the ERA from the list, then click Start Review. Each claim will display the amount billed to the payer, the allowed, paid, unapplied, and adjusted amount. The most important column to review is the status column as it contains actions and information that you should review before you apply your ERA payment. Depending on the remittance codes sent by the payer, you will be able to click on the icons and view informational messages, alerts, warnings, and errors. Although informational messages do not interfere with applying the payment, they may contain business critical information regarding the payment of the charge and are important to view. For example, this message states that the payer did not make any payments to this charge. While this is important to know, it will not interfere when you apply the payment. Warning messages should be reviewed before you apply the payment, as there could be items that need to be addressed. You may receive a warning message that a charge has already been marked as paid, or an allowed amount does not match your contracted amount. For example, this warning message states that a payment from this payer has already been applied to this charge. The recommended step would be to remove this new payment from this ERA. If you choose to not follow the recommendation, you can apply the payment which will create an account credit. Errors are notifications that prevent you from applying the payment. You may receive an error message that the system is not able to locate the claim or patient. All error messages need to be resolved before a payment can be applied. For example, this error states that the charge for this payment cannot be found. You can either manually locate the charge the payment should be applied towards, or remove the payment from the ERA. You can view more details of each claim by clicking on the claim line. You can see each charge with the specific allowed and paid amounts along with any remittance codes. You can also apply discounts, credit and debit adjustments, account credits, or add info lines to charges. Once you are finished reviewing, click Done. Clicking the View EOB Report will show you a system-generated EOB for this ERA. This can be referenced if you want to view a detailed breakdown of the payment. Once the payment is complete, and all errors have been resolved, click Apply Payment. If you are not ready to apply the payment, you can click Save and Apply Later. From the ERA Search Results screen, click on an ERA line to edit any incomplete ERAs. View the EOB, mark any ERAs you have manually posted as applied, or change the check date. If you would like to start this ERA fresh, Open the ERA and click Restart ERA to undo any resolved errors, warnings, and payments. Now that you know how to post ERA payments, you can try it for yourself. For step-by-step -step directions, FAQs, and other how-to videos on the payment section, visit our Knowledge Center at help.collaboratemd.com. Thanks for watching.